Hi there, it's Maria from Summon. At Summon, we love testing out different AI features. Our founder, Andre Bass, has requested AI features on Bubble Form in March, and oh wow, they delivered it. So today I'm going to show you how we're using one of them in Bubble. It can skyrocket your development and might even save your neck. For example, if you need to present your app to stakeholders, but it's not quite ready yet. In 2024, Bubble has been actively rolling out new features, with updates happening almost every month. One of the coolest additions is the ability to create pages using AI. You can try out this feature even on a free plan without needing a Bubble account. Signing up for Bubble is quick and free, so I won't go into detail into that. After that, head to the dashboard. Open the whole page, click Create an app, Give your app a name and click Get Started. Choose the Start with the Basic Features option. Bubble gives you a pre-configured options landing page, dashboard, social feed and marketplace. I'll go with dashboard. Of course, the more detailed your prompt is, the better your results will be. I'm sure you could use your SRS for this. If you don't have one yet, I'll include a link into a generator in the description below. For now, I'm entering a very simple prompt, and I suspect the results won't be too mind-blowing. Still, let's hit Generate with AI and see what happens. Just for you, I timed the process. It took about 30 seconds. Bubble say they integrated GPT-3, Stable Diffusion and Dali under the hood. Alright, let's see what we've got. Since I didn't specify any styles or design elements, it looks like Bubble uses own, which aren't bad at all. I see menu items on the left sidebar, they are repeated, but it's no big deal to edit them and add my own. The top menu has a user profile option. On the dashboard itself, there are widgets like active projects, budget overview, and team status. I'm guessing that's team performance. Then there is a visualization of key metrics, which I can choose from drop-down. And finally, there's team members data, which is also customizable. You can preview the app in preview mode. Since I haven't created any additional pages or linked to databases yet, this is just a single page with no interface features. To create more pages, go back to the editor, select Add a new page with AI, and follow the same flow. But be sure to check the box for use the existing style variables. I'm confident this feature will save a lot of creations a ton of time. Of course, it's not a fully finished app, but it speeds up the initial setup and it's easy to customize later on. If your first app presentation goes well and you need help building out more advanced functionality, don't hesitate to reach out to the experienced team of Sono. Bye bye!